And we're back. Yep. Here we go. Let's go into the descent into the hell. The uh, descent. What a... The downward spiral. <laughs> the tower. <laughs> oh, we've, we've got a video title. Yeah. Uh, oh, oh, I should probably, I should bring up the Elgato. Oh, that's what I should do. Because this is a, this is actual PS2. I, I yeah. hear PS2 emulation is a thing now, but I, we don't know how to do it. We're stupid. Yeah. The man, maybe that way we could like. Uh, like play... It would probably look a lot better. Oh, he could play Breakdown. Oh, wait, where's that Xbox only? I forget. Breakdown. Oh, hello. Whoops. What? No. You exposed. <laughs> what exposed you? Oh no, you exposed me. I actually wear a nice robe. And smoke out of a pipe when I play these, when I'm not on camera. The Hawaiian shirt thing. It was just a ruse! Not wearing your Bullet Club tee today. No. <laughs> well, it's a good thing I'm wearing uh, bottoms. Sometimes I don't. Everybody Ooh. hates Spyro and the entering dragonfly. I, I too hate entering dragonflies. There's not much there. It's very But we have to. we have to try it. We have to... Jack doesn't believe that it's as bad as I say it is. I didn't say that. I, I said I, I couldn't... Did I say that? You, you, you kind of implied it. Like, how, how bad <laughs> could it be was kind of your attitude. Which, you know what? Since you haven't played it, that's probably a good attitude. Let's change that. <laughs> All right. I'm going with my expectations pretty low. Just like, okay, it's probably bad, but it can't be unplayable. Equinox. Digital entertainment. Yep. This would be allowed in modern day and like uh, just a static what, having image. a game this bad. Well, just have just having a static image that says lo <laughs> it says loading. Yeah, you really hate this game. Uh, it's baby dragonflies, aren't they adorable? Well, I like the animation so far. Spyro yeah. doesn't look too bad. Looks acceptable for PS2. Yeah. Is it? Oh, oh, you should probably get the PS2 controller. Yeah, no, no, no. <laughs> I'm still using the still using rock the Logitech. Oh, hey, we get to see. Uh, I don't want to see any gameplay though. Don't, don't, Why no not? attract, no attract mode. I'm. But maybe it's like an opening cutscene. No, I don't you know. spoiled the fact that we go to Japan. Now I'm gonna look forward to, to playing Japan, and I can't go to Japan because this game's awful. It's the first level. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, loading. Okay, good, you're loading! You can get some unironic enjoyment out of Spyro 4 if you just imagine Spyro finally got to go to the beach in Laoku Island. Okay, okay. What, what, is that the first level? Is that Japan? Alright, we're going... We're going to Japan! Half of it's a loading bar, the other half is a static fucking image! Japan, number one! Forever! <laughs> Forever! Slot one. Forever! Oh, see, that's how far I made it. 2%. <laughs> Alright. Oh, you get a save icon. Uh, you wanna be a what, cow? You wanna be got? sexy hunter? Hey, hunter. Yeah! Money bag, still there. Bear! <laughs> Bear <laughs> wizard! <laughs> oh no! Hillbilly? That? Dragon? That? Hey, dragon. Robot? Cow. I just, okay, I'm not gonna talk too much about it until Jack's playing it. There will be there will be plenty of time for this game. Oh great! How long did Spyro Three take? I don't know how long we were at that. Whoa! 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 It's just a float, you scaredy cat. Still, still Tom Kenny. They sure do look happy. Same voices. Don't they, Spyro? <sighs> well, it's not every day that a dragon gets his dragon back. <laughs> I, I see we're at uh, the level of 3D, uh, uh, same as Food Fight. Yeah, there, there goes the animation. Oh. Uh, who is it? Rhinoc? No, Ripto. Nasty Dork and. No, it's just Ripto. Oh. I'm back. Same I'm guy. Stronger than ever. Okay. Who are you calling little, Shorty? Nobody invited you. This is an invitation only party. 
Very clever, Dragon. You know, you should join me. We would make a great... Really? Wait, really? What do you want this time, Ripto? Oh, yeah. Oh, 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 oh. What do we want this oh, it time, talks. Boss? Fuck. You're not hired for your brains, you dinosaurian land mass. Keep thinking and I will send you back to the place I found you. Of I'm course they needed to be like dumb cohorts. That's never been done people. before. Now, back to what I was saying. Well, what do I want this time? I'm glad that you asked, Purple Pest. And I, will be I wonder if this is Stuart Copeland. The music. Probably not. To do with dragons, I thought. Perhaps dragonflies. I'm gonna, t I'm gonna kill all the dragon foot animation. It's like they just have to make everything move at all times. Yeah, I'll let you know. Hey, look, we can do this now. Look at how much his outfit is just flying everywhere. Look at what we can do! We got the budget for it! That little lizard totally stole all the dragonflies. The Bianca face. Even Sparks is gone. She's like, what? Whoa! I know where to start. <laughs> the sound mixing is garbage. <laughs> the, she just got interrupted by a shouting dude. <laughs> just for a few seconds. Maybe the track will play in the next uh, in the first level. All right, I'm, I'm ready. Let's see how this. Let's see how this game fucking plays. The bar is just for loading that image so that they can then load the game. <laughs> I, I, I would put it past. Sparks, I thought I lost you, pal. Maybe they were supposed to be layered o one over the other, and they just fucked it up. Yeah. <laughs> this game was rushed. That was close, Sparks. Really, I couldn't tell. I figured out a way to catch those dragonflies. Spyro, stand back. Magic. Stock sound effects. Whoa! What'd you do that for? Draft. That didn't exactly work right. I'm still learning, you know, Spyro. The good news yeah. is I've created a powerful magic that will enable you to use different breath abilities. The oh, cool. The bad news is you're going to have to find dragon runes to use them. But I There's liked fire. In different parts dragon of runes? Cool. Come on, Sparks. Let's get going. Oh, we got to read the word in order to know how it... Do you think we'll ever get a day off? Bless Tom Kenny's heart. He did this for them. I'm Tom Kenny, and I like, and I like dragons. Tom Kenny as Parthenax. Yeah. Hey, it's animated! Nice! I like this one! This, yeah. This one's cool. He looks alright in game, just the cutscenes are so atrocious looking. Yeah, it's it's not good. It didn't age well. It's probably good at the time, but. No. <laughs> you just looked at it, you're thinking, this is fucking garbage! Yes. <laughs> Cool loading. Is this the game? Are we in it? <laughs> cool s rising sun on that cloud. Maybe if you spin it, Master Roshi will appear. Oh. Hey man, this game is ahead of its time. Okay, no, never mind. That's some, uh, that's some, uh, Crash Wrath of Cortex tier loading screen. Uh. His first PS2 game not, is also, uh. Not a big fan of the frame rate. Yeah, frame rate's a little bad. What the fuck? Oh, he. Cutsy took over. Here, take this dragon rune to the dragon spirit over there. With this rune, he'll be able to combine dragon magic with my magic and grant you bubble breath to catch dragonflies. A bubble breath? Shown, that sounds I'm cool. That sounds like a badass ability I'd like to have. Wait. Catch dragonflies, they'll probably run away anytime you come near them. Use your L1 Is button this to switch Pokemon? back and forth between fire and bubble breath. Okay, so we have multiple uh, options for uh, uh, for doing breath. Alright. And an inventory. Okay. Oh, I can't use but. No, you have okay. to bring the rune to the dragon first. I, I'll give this game props. I do like the fire breath, the animation. Yeah. It's. Oh, well, I liked it better from the side. I like the fact that you, that it, it, like, it, it, it the curves. The smoke is up for some reason. Yeah. The smoke is... 
I mean, it's not, it's not a hundred percent good, but it's... I wonder who gets the honor of voicing Sparks. So we have to use Bubble Breath to cat. I can't just run up to them and just go... No, they'll run away. You killed it! That baby dragonfly is dead because of you, Spyro! Trying to... Angry buzzing. Oh, he wasn't talking about that, though. Oh, gosh. Uh... Save the frames. I have a feeling that... Okay, so you're talking about tank controls. This isn't tank controls. This... I didn't say tank controls, oh. but it, it kind of does that thing where uh, you have to fully rotate in one direction before he can then start moving in that direction. Yeah, I noticed that. That's not... Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's very non-fluid, I find. Yeah, it, it feels like there's some kind of, like, startup time when it comes to running. There is, yeah. Unless... Oh, lots of cutscenes. Love cutscenes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Tutorial things. You don't remember where to find butterflies? Just kill things, Spyro! Kill everything! Kill everything. Oh. No, I didn't mean to! I'm sorry! Oh! That's a dragon rune! So how do I use dragon runes? You I just do a dragon statue. Oh. Okay. Oh, it's a spirit dragon. Sure. Is that also Tom Kenny? Would surprise me. Okay, how does this work? <laughs> You're picturing something else, perhaps. No, no, no. I, I just the, the first time I used it, it was just so fucking delayed. This, this. I caught tunes. Well, oh, he says the same for everything. Every single dragon. Well, how many dragonflies can there be then? Oh, it only works on dragonflies. Yeah, it's not an attack in any way. It's purely utility for just getting dragonflies. Right, am I? Okay, good. This isn't the kind of game to kill me for walking in water. Lots of lots of voice lines. All right. Uh. Are you- does your controller Wait. stop working? Uh, Are you stuck moving in a- I'm- Spyro flaw, frolicking in a field for ten hours too, go! Can you, uh- can, can, I- <laughs> Holy Is shit! Is it the controller? Hop swap, go! Oh, uh, it- It fixed itself, I think. That was weird. <sighs> Well, I I don't know whether it was the game or the controller, and the fact that I have to say that is a bad sign. I was about to compliment this game too. I was gonna say the graphics aren't too bad. That's the only good thing about it is that the gameplay, for the most part, looks you know pretty nice for the PS2. But the cutscenes don't, and the gameplay itself is not great so, in a lot of ways. Okay, Flutter is. Is still here. Uh, oh, yeah, it's Hunter. Granted, the models do look better than they do in uh, like, like Hero's Tale. Hey, Spyro. You know, if you press the X button to jump, then press the X button again in midair, you can climb. Yeah, I know. Here, watch. I can do. That's not what I did. The poor souls who played this as their first Spyro game. I'm hesitant to call this a bad game so far. Yeah. So, I, it, I mean, sure, it's got some tech issues, but it doesn't... It doesn't seem like a deal-breaker just yet. But it, this game still has a lot of uh, opportunity to change my mind. It was mostly the controls. Like, I could not picture playing through a game of comparable length to Spyro 1, 2, and 3 with this kind of control. Uh, I, I will say that uh, if it comes between me starting to stream this or uh, starting to stream Ratchet and Clank, I'd rather do Ratchet and Clank. But of course, yeah. So far, what, what's going on? 
Check, Check out, out this big lock. It's uh, magic. If I have electric breath, I can open it. Okay. I've got breath for all the elements. Sure. That's a new gameplay gimmick. I like that the that it's just a single button press to cycle through though. That's uh, yeah. that would make that would make things a whole lot more tolerable. Okay, there's something here. I kept the sound effects. That's nice of them. <laughs> that this isn't so nice. This is kind of ugly. Yeah. This, uh, wait, uh, seven thousand gems. That's kind of low. Sure, yeah. Well, the last game was five thousand. And ninety dragonflies. That's sure. less than. Uh, I think that's more than there were like dragons in Spiral One, wasn't it? Probably. I don't remember Let's though. Let's see. Oh, okay. Uh. It gets lower the more you go on. Well, it seems to peak around the middle and then kind of peter off. Is that every to... level in the game? Okay, what do we got? We got the Dragon Realms. That's where we currently live. The Dragonfly Dojo. And I guess uh, Dragon Japan. Uh, Crop Circle Country. The 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 mid the flyover country. Uh, Luau Island, Hawaii. Cloud Nine, My the sky level. Dog on the island. Uh, Tibet, uh, Monkey Monastery, Honey Marsh, I guess we fight bees in a swamp. Oh boy, a thieves den, love a thieves level! That's the pirates level, I guess, and, uh, and Jurassic, Jurassic Jungle, Jungle, which seems like it'd be a great way to end it off a game. I'm guessing Dragon mm. Realms is the hub world, and all of that is, uh, all those are like the individual portal worlds? Mm. Seems like it. Because I remember reaching Dragonfly Dojo while playing this game. Alright, do I have to headbutt trees? No? Okay. Good. Wait, I thought you were over... here. You're not anymore? I guess not. Wait, guess what's back? This is power up here. Oh, it's a challenge portal. portal. Dragonfly sealed inside. Eight targets will appear. Oh. Spyro, you purple putts! I guess I you just have to walk through the jump on the, in the board, maybe. No? I should have paid attention. Oh, I have to charge through it. That's okay. very specific. Okay. Now the targets are scarecrows. Oh, you don't get any cool projectile flames. It just starts a, a challenge timer. Is all. Physical challenge. Oh. You gotta do the physical challenge. The audience needs it. But I'm I came here for the questions. Who comes here for the questions? Uh. Yeah. Meow. Is it down here? I don't know. Hold on. There are two there. No, this just leads to uh, energy gate. Music's all right. Yeah. All right. Sounds Spyro-esque, but with more, uh, more violins, more fantasy elements. Yeah. The fantasy instruments. Oh, but it doesn't have. It's not a complete fantasy. It doesn't have all the fantasy instruments. There's no electric guitar. And Is that, that a fantasy instrument? We need to go all. We need to go full Dragon Force. Oh, okay. Or uh, full Rhapsody. Spyro, but with a Rhapsody of Fire soundtrack. That'd be pretty cool, honestly. Hey, Spyro! Oh, we should have played that for, uh, fighting the Empress. Like, Power of the Dragon Flame oh, or something. Oh, man. That, that was a better option. <laughs> Power of the Dragon Flame. That was the finale to the first arc. Way to go! Oh. I think I see something shiny. I'm Hunter. I'm, I'm, I'm getting the... I'm getting the... box. Do I have the manual for this one? I do. Let's see what this is like. Damn it. Ah. Hunter! If you, if you fuck up any 
of his directions. He just fucking, uh, he just fucking bounces back. Yeah. Fucker. Just stay where you are. Oh, PlayStation 2 setup. Remember those PS2s? Oh, yeah. <laughs> the, the OG ones? Oh, can you head bash? Uh, I... Oh, um, yeah, you can. You jump still can. Jump triangle? Yeah, you still can. Oh, what, what, what vehicles are in this game? Do we get a tank? We, we get, get a, a tank? A plane? Why do we get a fucking tank? UFOs are back. And a manta ray. <laughs> Wait, a manta ray? No, come... Potter! Stop running back! Just wait for me! He doesn't even say I fucked up, he just repeats himself from the very beginning. Good game design. Hunter! Oh man. I think they use even uh even like lower def models in the in the manual. Look at that Bianca and money bags. <laughs> money bags ah, looks dude. like an alpha version. <laughs> Fucking shit. That's uh, uh Hunter! No, no, let me see that again. He's just, he looks like a Russian doll that you take apart and put other dolls inside. You know, yeah, that, that looks like some uh, SNES, uh, like like when they were uh, doing the models for Le Legend of the Seven Stars. That looks like that. What are you doing? I, I was gonna show them. <laughs> All right, fine. I'm in my jammies. Sure, it's my day off. Shut up. Probably can't see. I don't know. Hold on, we'll find out. Uh, the yeah, that's good enough. Oh lord, your jammies. That's so lewd, Jack. <laughs> like... All right. <sighs> okay, I gotta do that. I keep I keep stopping way too early. Can we just? No, you gotta do it right, Spyro. He's gonna go there and he's gonna like, Yippee, now come back to the first ledge and see if you want to practice that again. Or something equally stupid. Oh. Uh, press L2 and R2 at the same time. Now? What does it do? Uh, well, when you get the chance. Alright. There we go. What do you have to say to me now? Nice work! Hey, I got a dragonfly! I bubbles. caught bubbles! bubbles. Alright, L2 and R2. He's looking at me. Can you not do it? Maybe L2 and R2, sorry. Yeah. Okay, I'm doing it. Maybe, I guess it's a move you have to unlock. Oh, it I says, can sit! It says he has a deflect ability. If you uh, press L2 and R2 simultaneously, it puts his wings in front of him. I, I can't do it, so I guess that's, uh, that's another thing. It's a very short I, manual. I feel like Clyde in this game is a bit more generous. Oh, Billy West is in this. Oh, is he? As is, is D. Bradley Baker. I would assume that's Sparks, because D. Bradley Baker is the an cartoon animal voices guy. <laughs> Makes sense. Good work, Spyro. Miyagi! Sure. Of course he's, like, stereotypically Asian-sounding. Yeah. I'm... Dragon... So it's not a portal, you just get on a platform and it raises up, and, uh... That's how, that's how you get to levels. Even the Ripto on the cover... Looks like a, like a beta model. Oh my god. Oh, by the way, he's on a boat now, but it's still flying. Sure. Boat to Japan. I'm going to Japan. <sighs> Ripto should have died. Spiral games are always you, end with bad are, guys. Are you loading? Get game. I know when I feel like it. Oh, here we go. <laughs> that was Crash's first PS2 game. Also had really bad loading times. Yeah. Oh no, Spyro! Oh it looks no! Like the Riptox have frozen all the Dragon Masters. 
Again? So, so, oh. So Ripto has like a fake you Rhinox now, I guess. Yeah. Alright, yeah, I'm sorry for skipping through all the dialogue. I just. I guess they kind of figured just like the frames wouldn't be a problem. I. I'm guessing so. Is put is, everything on the field, spawn it all at once, it'll be fine. Draw distance! We don't need no stinking draw distance. Maximum draw distance. We have, we have this game has to look good. I should have I should have gotten hit there. Oh hey. Steffi. Just picturing Tom Kenny in a booth going through the lines of all, was it 90 dragonflies you don't in one need sitting? To, you don't need to do that! Like, just to have the text! Doesn't really improve the game. This is where all their budget went. This is why it got all used up and the game had to be rushed to production. Oh god, I, I really don't like this gym placement just being out here. On the edge of the They're, cliff? Yeah. Be careful, tee hee. It's just, it's busy work. It's just like, you're, oh, check every square inch of the level. Don't go to like, like one cave and put 20 gems there. Oh no, sir. So would you say that was more what the previous Spyro games, like gem hiding was like? I didn't, I don't like, I don't like. Or was that a complaint with like all of them? I don't know. I, I, I. I mean, the gym, hunting down gyms, like, just searching every nook and cranny or something. Yeah, it, not really my cup of tea. But, uh, I'm not gonna say that if pe that people don't like to do that. I'm not gonna say it's bad game design when people, when there's obviously enough of a market for game to get kickstarted based on nothing but that. And for people to, I'm talking about, uh, uh, the fuck am I talking about? What game am I talking about? What, what, are, what are you saying? The, the Banjo Kazooie spiritual successor. Uh, Ukulele. Yeah, that, that's the one. Uh, I mean, people still like that game, despite it, despite its uh, terrible reception. So, a lot of overhype is part was part of that. I mean, people wanted a Banjo Kazooie game. They got a Banjo Kazooie game. Yeah. That's base. I'm sure there's other stuff that I'm missing. Hey, all right. <laughs> okay, Spyro. Spyro, thank goodness you had the sense to Bruce. Me from that icy cage. Get it? Who would have thought the Rift His last name is Chan. The sacred <laughs> dragonfly dojo. Then we'll find. Uh, Spyro, do what you can to return the dojo to its peaceful state. Then we'll find Jackie Lee. All of yeah. the dragon masters. Remember, Spyro, the way of the dragon is to be a dragon. So it's race limited then. In order to become a dragon, you must be a dragon. Be dragon. a dragon, got it. Dragons we are, less dragons we become. I guess there's four left. Oh, no. This is five. Four dragon masters. Head. Is that what's taking up the frames, the water physics? Water looks pretty nice. Yeah, lots of ripples. Yeah, this this game is much slower than the previous three games. They made it was made for Japan. <laughs> they mugged the comfortable Japanese speed, right? But he's also big and fat, so I don't think Can't you can charge, charge him. him. Introduction to big enemies. Let's make a game based off of dragonflies. It's not like it couldn't have been done, this game's concept. Yeah. It's just the, the execution. Execution isn't perfect. <laughs> like this, that means your Save progress is saved. Yep, checkpoints, got it. At each time, a fairy, so it's not necessarily Zoe that's doing it. Oh, lots it's, of fairies. 
What, do they all look the same to you? Sand. That seems fine. Oh, fair. Oh, I'm faced. Or racist against me. I don't know. Because there is that legend about how, like, classical phase were, like, assholes. Yeah? Just... There's also the game Changeling Lost about phase kidnapping people and, like, turning them into, uh... Into, like, things that were not human and putting, like, fetches in their place. Fetches? You know, like, just things that look like the person, but are kind of sort of different. They're basically replacements for the people they kidnap. Okay. Because they need fresh humans. And one way to, uh... Uh, one way to lose the game is to lose all your morality. And then the Fae come back and they're like, It's time for you to become a Fae now! Yeah. Congratulations, you made it! Do you think maybe they were over-ambitious for this game? Uh... It, it seems like they put a lot of focus on, on the graphics and presentation. You, you're really not gonna like me for saying this, but it just feels like a slower PS1 game. Like, like this game, if, if you can increase the frame rate of this game and make it play a bit faster, I'm sure this game... Are you a grasshopper or are you an actual Olympia Firefly? Oh, it's Baby Dragon? Baby Dragon. Rusty. <laughs> All right, Rusty. Spyro is no longer the smallest dragon. Oh, okay. You want me to stand on you? Oh, so that wasn't a clue. All right, then. I mean, I, do, I don't disagree with you. I mean, the, the speed of the game is the main thing that kind of kills it for me. Yeah, it's, it's very slow. It's... I can't, okay. There's nothing to stand on except this... Wait! Hold on! I can't actually jump on this! No. Wait, that's way too narrow. Is it some kind of rock climbing dragon? Oh my god. Presumably we have to either bring something here or glide to it. No, you're still trying? I was just making sure. Uh... Yeah, they're... I have a feeling that they could have optimized this game, but, uh, yeah, it just feels so... Like, this was on the same generation as Ratchet and Clank. You remember how Ratchet and Clank was? Was it? Let's find, let's find out. Yeah, PS2, this was, uh... Well, it was the same generation, yeah. This is 2002, Ratchet and Clank 1, Ratchet and Clank. Here's the thing, though. I could, I if I if I got having that, if I had enough time and, and like I was bored enough, I could probably sit down with this game and complete it. But it just, I think, kid, you would have. I think I I could, but there's so many better games out there. Like this is. I was never suggesting this was like a Sonic 2006 tier. No, I know. It's just. I feel like uh, what you were feeling at the time wasn't really necessarily anger, just disappointment. Yeah. 2002. So same year. Yeah. So you have you have this game come out, right? And yeah. you have Ratchet and Clank come out, and Ratchet and Clank runs so much smoother and and actually has like some better game design. This, but I would. This does. I would say have better graphics than Ratchet & Clank. Uh, it's got lots of effects and sparkles and things on it, which is what I think led to a lot of these problems, is that they focus too much on appearance. Yes. Yeah, if they had... There's Jackie! The is in such a state for your visit. He's usually a haven of tranquility. It is here that dragonflies grow up and train to be dragon companions. If they had toned it back, if they dialed it back to what technology they had available... Yeah, this is... 
Well, let's make it was just too much for the hardware. Yeah, this feels like it could be. You could uh, you could upgrade the graphics a whole lot more and have it be like a. Uh... You know what? You know what? The console this game probably would have done better. This game probably would have done better on. PS3. Uh, I was gonna say Xbox. Yeah, I know Xbox. Uh, it, 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 it was more powerful than I, PS2. It, yeah, right? it was beefier than. Uh, it was beefier than PS2. This game probably would have done very well on uh, on the Xbox hardware. Yeah. This is what I'm getting from this. But it's not just the frame rate. Is the the frame rate is a big part of it. It's also the turning thing. The turning isn't really bothering me a whole lot. Really, it it, it killed feels, it for me. It feels very, like, I mean, I mean, it's there, but it's very slight. Like, I think I think you were I think what was causing you the most problem was the fact that the turning was very slight, but the frame rate wasn't really helping things. I think it was mainly the turning for me. All right, here you go. And the, and the movement speed is very slow. Yeah, I can't turn in air very fast. You see how incredibly slow that is? Okay. I can't, That's like in Spyro 1, 2, and 3, especially with more difficult enemies, you had to like bob and weave and move back and forth a lot. And you can't do that in this game. You can't 180 degrees. He's stuck with a very slow air, he has very low aerial mobility. I mean, I guess I guess that makes sense. That I, I wasn't really trying to turn around in the air, but it still, it still could be a whole lot worse. The area of mobility. It could be, but it's not good enough to merit me playing through the game as a kid. Yeah, I, I figured. I, considering that I wasn't really doing a whole lot of aerial maneuvering in that game, like in the previous Spyro games, I don't think it was. Well, and also a sequel should never be a downgrade, but, period. But look! The pedals are nice! Yeah. How can this be a downgrade? Look at the nice fucking pedals! What's over here? We get a minigame? Is a somewhere? Is that a level? No, we're in a level. I feel like... Some areas? Okay, wasn't this a, 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 a different team and yes, B? Yes, it was. It was rushed. So, I have a feeling that if we had the original team working on this game, they wouldn't have made those... They would have oh, probably sure. tried to kept the... Uh, I mean, that's the case with lots of franchises, though. That was the case with Crash, and... I, I think the Crash PS2 one turned out better. Some some people would argue, but... Was that Twin Sanity? Uh, no, that was uh, Wrath of Cortex. Oh. And uh, Ratchet and Clank changed hands after a few a few entries. Bonsai Speedway. Alright, let, let, here's a real comparison. Let's see how the Speedways uh, I think... do. I think Sly 4 wasn't in so wasn't Sucker Punch. Anytime a franchise leaves its original creators and is picked up by new pe new people, it never works out well. Well, that's only if the original franchise was good. I tried uh, to yeah, that's what I mean. Yeah, if if the if original franchise was dog shit, on the other hand, uh, you think of any uh, cases like that? Uh... Usually, if an original sure franchise is dog shit, it just doesn't get more games. Yeah, or if it, like, declines and... You know what? I wish there... Maybe there should be exceptions to the rule. Maybe there are exceptions to the rule. I mean, there's a big... The flying, is not... A the flying having... is not much better. Like the series having an ending is underrated. There's a lot of there's a lot of milking a series for as much as you can get out of it, both on the the business side and on the consumer side. I feel like a lot of people don't realize when a series is better off ending. Yeah. Indiana Jones. <laughs> Star Wars. Hey, Dark Souls did it. That's that is why Dark Souls is the best uh, trilogy. Yeah. <laughs> because because it ended on the third one. Yeah, uh... Dragon Ball! Wait, who <laughs> said that? Who's, what? What? What are you... <laughs> so is it down here next? Yes, it's, it's wherever you want to go. Oh, those guys are back, and they have eyes now. Do you hurt yourself if you charge into a wall? Really? Uh, there are stun frames? I don't think frames? so. You looked like you were stunned for a couple I, seconds probably there. Probably stunned, but not hurt. Well, that's what I mean. Yeah. Uh, it's only for this one, because... 
Oh, you hit square once, and then you're just constantly... Let's see what's going on. That was the case in your previous ones, too. Yeah, but I guess you... He just goes, Youch. What the fuck? What is that at the... Ah, oh, fuck. Hold on. If they're going in a circle, you're a lot faster to just continue going. Yeah. They seem like they're very generous with the time. This is basically a shittier uh, Spyro 3. Yeah? Like... Like, from just a pure, like, uh, conceptual standpoint, I have no problem with this game. This game feels like it's going the safe route with just aping, like, Spyro 3. I mean, they you know what? some new things, you like know, the different breaths. Yeah, and you know what? This game probably... It and probably turns. would have been a fine game for, like, a new generation, but... God damn. I don't... I, I'm just... You don't care anymore? I, here... I, I mean, I got all I needed to. If I wanted to play this again... I, I just played Spyro 3! I don't no, want to no, play Spyro 3 again! This yeah. is just Spyro 3 again, but with... Oh. Hashtag Crash Wrath of Cortex. <sighs> it was basically Crash 3 again as well. <laughs> what? what? Wow, they, both, they, these were both, they were both bought by Universal, too. So <laughs> Universal just got both a hold of them and said, You know how we can make some money? Let's just make the same game again. But yeah. <sighs> But with some slightly different things to uh, to amp up the sales, and in Wrath of Cortex's case, let's churn in that celebrity cast. Let's sell, let's sell them. They did this with they did that the same thing with fucking Enter the Dragonfly. They had a bunch of like. Do they have celebrities in this? They had voice act. They had they they voice have the acting celebrities. Voice actors. Uh, but they have the. the I think that their selling point was this one was let let's see how shiny we can make it. Let's see how good the graphics. Push the can envelope. Get. Uh, and then Crash was just his voice. And Mark Hamill was in it. And that's the thing, is that even even if you, from what I played of it, even if you manage to, like, get the heart, get the frame rate up and have it play faster, I don't know. There it would just be another Spyro 3. It would just be 3. Spyro 3 again. And and if that was the case, if it was just Spyro 3 again, I'd just be like, yeah, let's just, let's just play Ratchet and Clank yeah. for a while. And then play come back. New. They'd come back to this. But I won't, because, because this game... Feels like it would get really grating on me really quickly because of just the speed stuff. But I'm not gonna call it it's the not, worst game I've ever played. No, because it's not. It's just it's no. It's just not Sonic 06. It's, it's just incredibly underwhelming. It's slightly worse than, than Spyro 3. Yeah. <laughs> Which I don't know. I don't. I don't think I derive any enjoyment from this game just playing it like on stream because no, I you know, it's that's, Spyro. What? What more is there to say? I, I had I had never suggested we continue yeah, Spyro Four on stream. I know, and you know, and I'm not vetoing it. That's this is the, the thing. Sometimes I play through again. I'm like, no, let's just let's just keep going through it. Remember like Sonic let's, Shuffle. Yeah, that game tricked me. Yeah, it actually thought, hey, you know, this is actually pretty good. Give me a chance, and then it like, it got like worse. Play, yeah, this game is not really selling me on like the first Tinder date. I like, don't think it's going to get worse. I don't think it's going to get better. It's just going to be more of the same for another 20 levels. I'm not down with that. No, I'm done with this. All right. It's well, just... we, we saw it. We saw what happened to Spyro after the PS1. Final uh, Jack rating, mediocre. That's, that's about it. If you want to see what happened to Crash, I already streamed Wrath of Cortex. So you can go watch that. <laughs> we're done for today, and we're done with Spyro until Reignited is available, in which yeah. case maybe we'll do that. Maybe, but, we'll, uh, maybe we'll play the, sh the really shitty Spyro games, get some enjoyment from that. Oh, yeah. Crash Purple Spyro Orange we coming play, soon. We only, play, we only really devote time to good games on this channel. I feel like we need to just find something extra. Just I think terrible. everyone left, though, oh. once we started this one. <laughs> yeah. See, see you next time, see guys. See you next time.